What is going on everybody? Welcome back into the channel. My name is Rock Soldier and today we're going to be reacting to Legacy by Motionless and White. This was the recommended one uh, and I figured, you know, let's give it a shot. It's been like probably a little over a month uh, since I did my first Motionless and White reaction. So this will be my second. So I'm super excited to check out this track, guys. We're going to hop into this thing. Let's get it. Okay, okay, so far I was I'm digging this uh, more than the first track I did by them, which I'm drawing a blank on the on the uh, title of that track. But nonetheless, this is kind of giving me like, um, like the score vibes, but like heavier, right? Uh, especially just with the message and even kind of like the way or like the pacing of the song was made, right? Um, you know, and as extreme as it may be a little bit, you know, because right at, right at the beginning of the first verse, you know, do you want it? Die for it, right? You know, maybe maybe a little extreme, but you know, I guess it depends on, on what we're talking about, right? Um, but nonetheless, like the 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 message is still there, right? Just kind of having that that work ethic, right? Like if you really want to make your mark on something, uh, you're gonna have to work for it, and that requires a lot of sacrifice uh, and a lot of time, which is kind of what they're getting at, right? Um, but hell yeah, no, I'm I'm, I'm digging this so far. I like the crowd chanting. Sick. What will your legacy be? The darkest nights, the beds are cold. Live or die, your truth be told. I can hear it in my chains. Requiem from better days. Wow, that was clean. That was a clean transition there. I respect that. I like that. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's obviously like being a little extreme with it. Um, and like I said, you know, depending on the situation or exactly where you're trying to make your mark. Um, <clears throat> but uh, but like I said, you know, the message is still there. And, you know, I, I actually do kind of like the like hyperbolic um, like way they're, they're describing it, right? You know, the darkest nights, the bitter cold live or die our truth be told right um you know kind of just very like an extreme way of just kind of describing you know the possible challenges or sacrifices that you'll have to make uh when you truly want something right uh you know that not, not just like not just like oh i want a snickers bar or some shit right um but more like you know something you really want to your core really want down to your bones right that you just feel like you need to do um I also, like I said earlier, while while the song was going, you know, I said I really like when they got the like the like the crowd chant in there. I, I always think that's sick. So I, I, you know, I think those kind of elements always always make me imagine like what it would be like live, right? Like if I was hearing the song live, um, and you know, I always think you, whenever you can get the crowd into it like that, you know, it's always just like such a more like meaningful uh, experience. And then and then the transition they just did was was also really fucking dope. Oh, 
I'm going to say, I actually really like those few lines right there. What will I become forsaken or beloved too far away to touch? What will I become? And I feel like that kind of is touching on like the possible disconnect that could happen, right? When you become so focused on this path to, uh, you know, your legacy, right? Um, you kind of become just so consumed, uh, you know, do, will you be forsaken or will you be beloved? You know, you kind of lose, you can kind of lose sight of, of where exactly you were originally intending, um, you know, to go a little bit, right? Just in kind of pursuit of leaving that mark, right? So I actually do kind of like that they touched on that. I do like the chorus. The chorus is good. Oh, yeah, this is the first one I did. Another one. That was the first song I did. All right, so that was Legacy by Motionless and White. Uh, and I enjoyed the track, man. I, I did. Like I said, kind of gave me, like, the score vibes, but, like, heavier. Um, right? So that was kind of cool because, you know, for most of you guys know that I dig the score. Um, and I definitely like this song better than the first one I did, which the first one I did was Another Life. Um, I just kind of like the pacing. I like the message here. I think it's very uh, interpretable. And you know, very open to interpretation uh, and very relatable um so it kind of makes the song like flexible and you can kind of adapt to your own to your own right um so overall man i gotta say i enjoyed it the chorus was sick they had some good transitions man I, like i said i like the crowd the crowd chants in there so overall man i thought the song was dope for sure man i certainly enjoyed it and i hope you guys did as well if you did please make sure to leave a like hit that sub button hit that button that we're dropping the next one and that's all i got for you guys for now it's your boy rock soldier hope you have a great rest of your night better tomorrow See you guys in the next one. All right, guys. Peace.